For this problem, we need to write this. Uh, for this problem, we need to write this system in the form of ax equals b, and then we need to find a inverse and the solution x. Um, so in this formula, a is your coefficient matrix, x is the vector of x1 and x2, and b is your um, solutions. So the coefficient matrix A would be uh, 5, 12, 7, and 17. Um, X, of course, is just x1, x2. And B would be 5, 5. Okay, when we have AX equals B, um, if we solve for a inverse, we can multiply both sides by a inverse, and that'll allow us to solve for x. Um, so to calculate a inverse, Uh, here's the formula for the inverse of a 2 by 2 matrix. The A and D are switched around, the C and B become negative, and divide by the determinant. Um, so first let's find the determinant of A. Um, the determinant is, uh, we multiply across the diagonals. So 5 times 17 minus 7 times 12. 5 times 17 is 85. And 7 times 12 is 84. So the determinant is 1. That's cool. We don't really have to divide by anything in this case. So now let's write uh, A inverse. Okay. Um, 17 and 5 are switched around, so. And 7 and 12 become negative. Cool. Now we can use A inverse to solve for x. Uh, we do that if we have AX equals B. Multiply both sides by A inverse. And we're left with X equals A inverse B. Um, so A inverse B. have our A inverse 17 minus 12 minus 7, 5, and a is five, uh, b is 5, 5. So our, our result is a 2 by 2 matrix. Let's apply row and column. 17 times 5 uh, minus 12 times 5, and minus 7 times 5 plus 5 times 5. Um, so let's simplify that to be 17 times 5 uh, was 85. And 12 times 5 is 60. Minus 7 times 5 is minus 35 plus 25. And we can simplify that to 25 and minus 10. So that's all equal to x. So x1 is 25 and x2 is minus 10.